New agreement between the teachers union and the school board. Tens of thousands of kids will now return to the classroom for in-person instruction. It is a first day of school reset. No kidding. Yeah, Matthew Archick live this morning at the Fort Hayes bus compound with what students can expect on their first day back and hear from the superintendent. Yeah, absolutely right, Matt. Monica, yeah, the school buses are getting fired up, getting ready to head out on those early morning routes. But I'm joined here by Dr. Talisa Dixon, of course, the superintendent with Columbus City Schools. Certainly exciting morning, Dr. Dixon. Uh, first off, we know that there's still one more step in this agreement really becoming official. When can we expect the board to review the contract, to sign it, and for, again, this to be officially official? Yes, yeah, so the board is um, meeting this morning, so it should be officially official um, later this morning. Okay, exciting. What can you tell us uh, about the agreement, about the middle ground that the two sides were able to maybe reach so that you guys could get back to this point and get back to in-person learning? Well, I can't discuss it yet until it's actually signed, but then once it's signed, we'll be, be able to disclose more details. How exciting is it to be back in school? You know, we know for the students, not just socially, but learning-wise, it is so important for them to be in the classroom and for that in-person instruction. So for you guys and for the students, just how important is it to be, be back here today? Well, it is essential. You know, we want want our students to be in the classroom with their teacher. That's where the optimum learning takes place. And we're just so excited to be at this point. I know our students are ready to see their teachers as well as our teachers are ready to meet their students. So it's a good day in Columbus City Schools. Have you had a chance to, to, to speak with anybody out here this morning? Some of the bus drivers that speak with any of the teachers just about their excitement about getting back and getting back into this routine? Well, actually, I met with some teachers last, um, last Friday as I was visiting the um, building and people are excited. You know, they're excited and they're ready to teach. They were getting their classrooms together. And that's what's important. You know, teachers want to be in a classroom with their students. Um, I spoke to some of my student ambassadors who are, are really ready to see, to get in a classroom. Many of them are, will be seniors this year. Just really ready to get in school and going back to doing those, um, those student activities and all of those extracurriculars and just being a student. Yeah, I'm sure that the, after the last couple of years, I'm sure they're very excited to be yes, back. Thank yes, you so absolutely. much. Thank you so much, Dr. Dixon. Yeah, Matt, Monica, uh, again, certainly really exciting day. The students will be uh, back in school here. And again, we'll have uh, more information on that contract once it is officially signed coming up later this morning. But for right now, Local Fuel Columbus, Matthew Herchick, NBC4. A lot of parents very excited as well about them being back in the classroom. Thank you, Matthew. You can find more details on the finalized contract and information about the first day of school for Columbus City Schools by heading to our website, nbc4i.com.